<clears throat> I wanted to show you how I did these ears. Um, so far, this is the fastest way that I've seen. So, um, this is this whole big sheet, half of it, just fold it in half. Fold it in half. No, no, no. Oh, okay. Fold it in half just to get that crease, but then unfold it, and then you're just going to fold these corners in, and you're just going to make the shape of the ear. So it's just two folds, and I'm going to just do it symmetrical on the other side. And I don't want to spend, I don't want to spend too much time on this because I have to finish ten, so I have to go kind of quick. Then, see this is kind of big, so I'm going to make it smaller. So that it actually touches in the middle. And then I'm going to just put glue on it. And paste it together. And since the one I'm actually going to put this ear on is smooth. So I'm not going to... I'm not going to put... Well... Yeah, I'm going to put fur on it. These strips that I already cut, I'm just going to paste them on all the way up. And see. I already have cut. And then I'm just going to put the brush it on pretty much because I need to get a bunch of glue on here otherwise it's just going to be like, it won't be, they'll stick out. And you want to get a lot of glue on the corners and sides. I already did this video like three times, right? And then <sighs> all these mistakes. So this is the third time. But I'm trying to do it good. So here's the strips. And I'm just going to put it on pretty quickly. And don't worry about the side sticking out. Just make sure it doesn't stick out a whole bunch because otherwise you're going to be wasting paper. But regardless, you're just going to cut it off at the end. Don't fold it over or anything. Oh, and I'm going to make these ears kind of long. Not as long as the other ones, but I think this is the perfect length right here. So, uh, Josh, all the paper I gave you is already pre-cut to this length so you should have a problem um, and then after it's done I already cut these black paper right here to make the inner part I was going to do it pink but then I decided not to because I don't know I just don't like I just want to keep it simple and there's not enough black on this. Well, since I'm not going to put stitches on it, I want to put some sort of black on it. Just because I prefer like kind of like gothic, dark, clean styles. I don't know. I didn't want to make it too like Easter Bunny, like typical stuff. Okay, so that's the ear. Just flip it over. And get the sides of this. That's the most important. It's just the sides. And just make sure that you don't soak it with glue. Otherwise it's just going to rip. And you're just going to have a hard time. Okay. <clears throat> so that's that. And I guess I'm going to put this one down. And I found that you don't need to do anything to make this stick on. All you need to do is just put spray glue. Um, I'm gonna get... Uh, spray glue really is the best for this, so I'm gonna probably get some more. And then you just put it on the inside. See there's like a pocket. And it dries really quickly and you want to be really careful with this because it's just a mess. And you just stick it on. Open up so it's in the middle of the hole. And then you grab the edges, the sides of it. And you press it down. So make sure like 
all of this, you press it down so it sticks to the body. And there it is. <laughs> It'll stick up naturally. Um, you can see the other one is smaller, but um, it <clears throat> it's still gonna come out cool. Like, oh look, you gotta be careful though. I usually wouldn't put fur on this since it's like a smooth piggy bank, but I thought I would just try it. I don't know, I've done it before. It came out alright. I think I like it. So that's it.